Hello everybody and welcome back. So in this video I'm going to show you how to download your designs that you have made in Canva. That is canva.com. That is the website you will be going to and this is the video where I'll be showing you how to download all of your designs. Okay, so I'm going to give you a few different examples. For example, JPEG, PNG, GIF, all of these different things. And we're just going to be downloading them and I'm going to be showing you how to download them. Okay, so it's as simple as that. So let's just get straight into it. So first of all we're just going to go to this one just here and click on it and let it load and in the top right just here we're going to want to click download like so and as you can see you have many different options you have JPEG, PNG, PDF standard and PDF print and at the bottom you have animated GIF slash movie and it's experimental so there could be some issues so make sure you just note that because if you want to do a GIF there may be some problems as it is new to Canva and of course with new things there's always bugs so yeah just just remember that okay so of course, a JPEG, a PNG, with a PNG you can download with a transparent background if you have one, but as you can see this is not a white background, this is coloured with a sort of texture on it, so we do not want a transparent background. Or JPEG, you can always download as a JPEG image, that's awesome. And then we have PDF standard, PDF print, so if you want to email it to someone, you can email the PDF standard, but if you want to print out the file you have downloaded, you can print it out as a PDF print version, okay? And we'll be looking at animated GIF slash movie later in this video. So don't worry about that. So we're just going to click JPEG, recommended, and then hit download. So here we go. We'll just say hold type, prepare in your design. And then you'll get a nice little quote at the bottom you can read there. And then it will just be downloading your design in any second now. As soon as this bar gets to the end. Okay, so that's awesome. Okay, there we go. It has now downloaded. So all you want to do is click on that file. And there you go. So you can see your file has been downloaded. That is fantastic. And that is, of course, in a JPEG format. You can see .jpg in the bottom left of my screen just here. Blackbrick.jpg. So that is fantastic. So now let's go back to this image and click download once again. And now let's go to animated GIF slash movie. So let's click preview animation. Here we go. So it's preparing. And there we go. So you have six different animation styles. So you have rise, bounce, slide, block, 3D and fade. And a quick note, this is only in the premium or pro version of Canva, whatever you want to call it, and that costs $12.95 per month. So that is just something you will want to note, as obviously you will need to pay for it. But there is a free 30-day trial if you want to try it out and see how it is. So at the moment, I have the free 30-day trial, and that is what this is like, okay? So you're going to want to pick the one that you want to download. So let's just pick this one here, Rise, and then you can either download it as a movie, so that will be an MP4 file, or you can download it as a GIF, so that'll be dot gif okay so let's just do download as gif and then afterwards we'll come back and do download as movie so that we can compare the two so let's hit this button now and this is a gif which we are downloading okay so it's just going to scan the entire file and make sure that it is working correctly for us and as you can see it is animation.gif at the bottom left just here so let's click that now and here we go so this is it and there you go so that's that so if we close that now and click download as a movie there we go. So it's just going to scan it once again and this time download it as a MP4 file. Okay, so there'll be no sound. It will just be the video, but it will be MP4. There you go. So animation.mp4. So let's click that one. And there you go. So it's actually lower quality, but as you can see, it's in experimental stages at the moment. So there's nothing to worry about there. Okay, so let's close that. And then, of course, you can choose any of these different styles you want. But yeah, just need to follow what I've just showed you. And it's as simple as that. Okay, so now let's move on to the final one we're going to do, and that is PNG. So for that, I'm going to show you how to download it with a transparent background. Okay, so I'm just going to delete my background right now. As you can see, this is a transparent background with nothing on it. So we're going to click download, PNG, and then tick transparent background. So let's tick download now. Let's click that button. Here we go. Hold tight, preparing your design. Fantastic. And then we get a nice little quote here. Creativity takes courage. And that's by someone called Henry Matisse. So that's quite cool. And now we have it downloading. So there we go, blackbrick.png. And there we go. So all you see is the B. So if you have a look back at the file, the only item that is visible is the B. And if you have a look, that is because it's a PNG. So the entire background is black and there's nothing there. So as you can see, all of this text here is black. So you're not going to see anything. So hopefully you understand what I'm trying to say. If you're doing a PNG, don't use black. <laughs> okay, so that's very important. So what I do, I change this color here. And then what I'll do, I'll just click on this square and just change it to a grey colour. Let's just see this one just here. It doesn't look too nice, but 
It's just for an example for you. So all you'll see is this B and the square behind it, and you'll see none of this text. You won't see lack brick, and you won't see the ultimate online courses. So let's download PNG transparent background. There we go, just downloading, it's preparing your design. The best way to predict your future is to create it. Abraham Lincoln. It's a nice little quote there. So let's click on this now. And there you go. So all you see is the B and the square, just like I said. With PNGs, it is transparent. So you need to make sure you have a white background on Canva. And you don't want to be using any black text because you will not see it. So make sure you just note that. I'm just going to do Control Z a few times and bring everything back. There we go. And yes, yeah, so that is that. That is how you download items and designs you have made on Canva. So that is everything you need to know. Of course, if you want to do a PDF, you can just click that. But I'm not going to show you that in this video as that is nice and simple. You need to do what we've done with the other file formats. Okay, so that, that's everything. That's fantastic. So hopefully you all understand it now. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And hopefully you learned a lot. And I will see you in the next video very soon. Goodbye.